run a demolition derby on 1973 Chevrolet Impala. I was at the Luray Fairgrounds and uh, got down to three of us and the transmission line blew and the whole car engulfed in flames. Yeah, it was very scary. Never experienced anything like that in my life. It was rough, I thought I was gonna die. They took me in the ambulance to uh, Page Memorial Hospital. They flew me here. And so once I got here, they took me right in and started doing the work to me. When he came in, he was pretty sick. Anyone that we say is it's a burn greater than about 20% tends to be pretty sick for the first 24 or 48 hours of their care. The burn creates just such a, an insult to the body that the only way it has to react is to start acting like you've got a really bad infection. Um, something like sepsis or septic shock. 30%, yep, uh, hands, legs, and then I had a place on my face. Yeah, it was rough, very sore, you know, just tightness, I guess your skin growing back. And, you know, I just done what they told me to do and everything worked out okay. I went through six surgeries. So he required some, some aggressive care in the first couple days. But we got him to the operating room and got his burns cleaned up pretty quickly. Typically with big burns like that, we don't want to make someone sicker by creating more wounds by taking their skin. They're already trying to deal with the, the injury they've had. And so, you know, we use some of our technological advancements to just kind of cover and temporize and start the healing process in all of his burns. He had kind of gotten over the hump and was ready to start undergoing the skin grafting process. And in his case, we were able to reduce the amount of skin that we would have otherwise needed to cover him because we used some of his own skin in the standard fashion, but then we also used a lot of the spray-on skin. Um, and what that does is, A, it allows us to use a little less skin when we're using it in the standard fashion, but it also allows that area to heal quicker than it otherwise would have if we didn't use the spray-on skin, too. So it's less skin, but heals quicker. Yeah, it was very good. They would give me full information of what they were going to do, you know, each step and how it was, you know, going to go. Just made you feel that it was going to be okay. Nurses are very involved in every aspect of, of patient care. Um, we have therapy involved with all of our burn patients right away because we know that the hardest part is going to be getting back on your feet. I didn't expect for it to happen this fast, you know, to be completely healed up and working on derby cars again. It went great, you know, hopefully no one ever has to get burned again, but if they do, I, I hope they get sent here. They do a good job.